the toastmasters education program called pathways got a major upgrade last month you can now access the material on your computer tablet or even a mobile phone the user interface is slick and responsive in this video i look at seven cool things you can do with the new system starting with number 7 sending letters of recognition go to toastmasters.org and log in to your account enter your credentials and click login once you reach your home screen click on achievement board the achievement board is a comprehensive list of your achievements in toastmasters including your education achievements your leadership achievements and your club support select education awards this shows you a list of all the education awards you have achieved in toastmasters if you have achieved level 3 level 4 or level 5 you have an option to send a letter of recognition click on the hyperlink enter the name of the recipient this could be your supervisor manager someone who will appreciate the effort you have taken to improve your communication and leadership skills enter the address in this case i will enter my own address so you can see how the letter looks and click send your employer will get a nice email directly from toastmasters international click on it and this is how it looks every time you complete an advanced level you can send this letter till they get the hint that it's time to promote you once you complete any pathways level you can print digital certificates you could do this in the old system but it was not as easy click on basecamp and navigate to achievements It takes some time and eventually all your achievements in Basecamp are shown. The learning badges are awarded once you complete any level. I have completed quite a few of them. You can also receive badges from your club members. And finally your certificates are stored here. Click on the expand. You will see all the certificates awarded and available as PDF files for printing or download. click on any one and that's what you get click here to print or download only the certificates earned in the new system are displayed here coming back to badges all badges earned can be shared on your social media click on the badge that you want to share as of now you can share directly to linkedin or facebook click on the platform of your choice let's say linkedin put your comments or thoughts and click on the post button that's all there is to it if you want to post the badges on other platforms like instagram whatsapp click on the copy url you can post this url on any social media channels websites etc it is now very easy to give feedback to other members or even request feedback the feedback that you give does not have to be about the speeches they deliver it can be about anything that they have done for the club or even for themselves perhaps a member did exceptionally well in a role like a toastmaster of the day perhaps you want to give them some suggestions to improve themselves to get started click on the feedback section we have two types of feedback the member feedback and the evaluation feedback we'll get back to evaluation a bit later on right now let's focus on the member feedback to give feedback click on give feedback select your club If you belong to multiple clubs it will show a list let me select quiz challenges then select the member or members you can give feedback to multiple members if you wish in this case i want to give feedback to a specific member so let me choose just one and i'll remove this one write your feedback you can attach a badge along with the feedback let's say i found that very inspiring click on inspiring If the feedback was regarding a specific role that the club member has performed there are badges for that like topics master timer general evaluator and so on you can choose to make your feedback visible to all the club members or only to the member you are providing the feedback to since my feedback is a congratulatory message let's keep it visible to all club members and click on post feedback confirm by clicking on the post button and you are done You can also request other members to give you feedback. To do that, click on Request Feedback, select the club. 
you can request feedback from multiple members. Enter your request details. Once you have typed in your request, decide whether this request will be visible to all club members or visible to selected members only. Since I have selected only four members, I will make it visible only to them and send request. Click on send and then wait for them to log into Basecamp, look at my request and then provide me the feedback that I have requested. Want to know what your fellow club members are up to? It's very easy to do now. Click on your profile and choose my clubs. Since I belong to two clubs, both the clubs are listed here. Looking at the first club, ASSP Kuwait, click on view all to see all the club members. You can look at their profile by clicking on view profile. Here you get to see the details of the person, the achievements, all the levels they have completed, any badges and so forth, the feedback that they have received and visible to other club members. Also, you can give feedback directly to this member by clicking on give feedback or request feedback from the member. When you are ready to deliver a speech project at your club and an evaluator has been assigned to you, you can electronically request your evaluator to give feedback. To get started, click on feedback and select evaluation feedback. Let's say you are delivering a level 3 project called Inspire Your Audience. Locate the right evaluation resource. You can do that by clicking on the forward arrow to locate the resource or just click on view all and scroll down till you find the resource. To share this resource with your evaluator, click on the share icon here. Fill in the speech title. Identify which club you will deliver the speech. Let's say it's in Kuwait Challenges. Select your evaluator, the date that you will deliver the speech. If you have a specific request you want your evaluator to focus on, you can enter here. Once you have filled in everything, click on the send button. Your evaluator will now be able to provide you digital evaluation without the need for any paper. Possibly the coolest feature for me is the ability to deliver online evaluations for speakers. Whether the speaker sent me the evaluation request or no, I can still deliver an online evaluation. Let's say you have been assigned as an evaluator for a new member who's delivering their first speech, the icebreaker. All we need to do is click on feedback, evaluation feedback, then identify the resource from the list. The icebreaker is right here. Click on this small blue icon, enter the speech title. This should ideally be on the agenda. Select the club the member and the date. It is the same evaluation form that we used to fill as a PDF file, but now it can be filled digitally. Once the speaker has completed their speech, enter their feedback. In the first section, enter your observation about what the speaker did really well. In the second section, highlight all your recommendations. In the third section, list some action items for the speaker to really challenge themselves. Then rate them on their clarity of speech, their vocal variety, eye contact and so forth. And once you are done, click on share evaluation and that's all there is to it. Going forward, I plan to do all my evaluations digitally. The only exception is if I take up a role as an evaluator for a club that I don't belong to, then I won't be able to fill the digital evaluation form. I still will have to rely on the PDF files. And that is possible also. So there you have it. My top seven features of the new Basecamp in Toastmasters. What are yours?